Hi guys, welcome to Fit by 40. Today is Weigh In Wednesday and um, seems like it's been a while. I missed out last week or I just did not make a video last week. I had a horrible week, horrible, horrible week. Thank God I made it through somehow, some way. Um, but I am in a much better place this week, thank the Lord. And um, yeah, I hope to never have a week like that because I, I don't like skipping out um, on my way in Wednesdays. I don't like doing that. I want to be consistent. That is definitely a goal of mine. So um, I did weigh myself. I knew that last week wouldn't be good um, because of my birthday weekend. Oh my gosh. Um, and when I skipped on the scale a zillion times last Wednesday, the scale said that I gained four pounds. Um, I figured that it was a little bit off because of bloating and things like that. But um, yeah, I still, you know, was like, okay, still it is what it is. It says that I've gained four pounds. Yeah. So I thought this week would be even worse. But to my surprise, my weight is exactly what it was before last Wednesday. So I thought I was going to have to put up like four pounds and I was very prepared to do it because, I mean, the thing is, um, first of all, I have to be honest with myself and then I'm definitely not going to lie, be, you know, because I'm not going to gain anything by not telling the truth. This is my journey. It is what it is. If I gain weight, you know, is because my actions led me to gain weight. And if I lose weight, it's because of hard work and dedication. Um, so anyway, I am exactly at the same spot I was, which I'm, I'm still not happy about because um, progress, it's all about progress. Um, and moving forward. So with that being said, um, I had a bad two weeks as far as diet and exercise and that's why I am exactly where I was two weeks ago. Um, I walked for the first time in two weeks on Monday. I um, decided that I will, this month, November, um, I think I told you guys before, is November because um, no excuses, no senseless snacking, no weight gain. Yeah, so like I really, really want to focus and be dedicated because I think this month is probably going to be the hardest month with my birthday being at the end of October. And then from there, there's Thanksgiving and Christmas. And, you know, it's just a really, really hard time to stay focused, but I'm not giving up by any means. So, so far I have done some um, form of exercise every day this month. Mind you, it hasn't always been like um, sweating, you know, really hard. Um, but I have done something and I, my plan is to, you know, sweat really hard and really make the um, workout count. So that's my plan. The other thing that I want to talk to you guys about is, uh, okay, so um, with my couponing, I picked up this protein shake mix um, at CVS for free. And this week, it was free. Um, yesterday was the last day to actually get it for free, but you can get it for $5 um, for the rest of the week. And the reason being is because there was a manufacturer's coupon for $5 off that expired on yesterday, the 6th, but the, um, I call it the magic coupon machine is also printing out a coupon for $5 off. This is regular price about $18, $19.
it's on sale for $9.99. So with that $5 off coupon, you'll get it for $5. But when I combine the two, I got it for free. And um, I'm definitely going to try it. I mean, why not try it for free or even $5, you know, great deal. Um, yeah, that's why I'm, I'm going to try it. Um, I've been doing really bad with eating breakfast. To be honest, I have not had breakfast in probably pro maybe even three weeks. I, I ran out of um, oatmeal and I, I have the oatmeal at the house, but I have not um, prepared my oatmeal the way that I do. And I'll make a video and show you guys how I prepare it. Breakfast is the hardest meal for me to eat because I am not a morning person. I'm not a breakfast eater. If if I had to choose between sleep and breakfast, it would be sleep. It has to be quick and easy for me. But like I said, I'm going to give this a try maybe as a breakfast replacement or, you know, alternating it with my um, oatmeal or maybe even for lunch. I, I don't know. Um, we shall see. The other item, and I will definitely do a review you know one of these days maybe to show, tell you guys what I think about it the other thing that I picked up um, was this item doesn't have anything to do with dieting but um, I've been my hair has been getting um, thin around you know the front I have very very thick hair have always had thick unmanageable hair um, always but in the front it is like thinning out i don't know if it's because of old age or um someone said it could be because of yo-yo dieting i don't know if anyone has ever watched the show that used to come on ruby on the style network i absolutely loved her but um she's on a, she was on a weight loss journey and she had her hair was really really thin really 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 thin in the front of them, I'm thinking maybe, you know, I'm suffering from whatever she is because of yo-yo dieting. This, you know, this is just me diagnosing myself like I um, often do. But I um, also picked this up from CVS because Magic Coupon Machine had given me a coupon for $2 off and I had a manufacturer's coupon for $4 off, which took off $6, making me pay four dollars of course i picked up two of these and one of these and i paid 97 cents um for all of it but um i believe that this is basically just a multivitamin but um everything that's in it focuses on i guess um hair skin and nails and I'm not really concerned about the nails I have really healthy nails I mean they're the day I turned 18 I don't know how else to describe it but they started growing and they're really thick and really healthy nails skin not so much but I think that's because of being overweight um, and I not really into taking supplements for these reasons but i don't think that um this one's a bad one i haven't tried it yet it's still not open i bought this on Monday. what i'm going to do is um alternate this is my regular multivitamin that i take or that i was taking faithfully every day until i stopped eating breakfast about three weeks ago but i will take this one day and the next day i will take this this and then this and that's what I'm going to do. My husband was saying that, you know, don't combine them because this is, he says that this is basically a multivitamin. So that is what I'm going to do. I will let you guys know if it helps, if I think it's helping in any way. I'm, I'm not trying to recommend these items. I'm just throwing out there to you guys what I'm doing right now. That is about it. Somehow I um, managed to make another long video but um anyways yeah that's it guys um back on track oh my gosh I, um i have lost 50 pounds but not um since i've actually not from the day that i started counting so 
of course, that's my next goal is to knock out, you know, the um, four or five pounds that I need to get to to be officially at 50 pounds, according to when I started this journey. So, oh, my goodness. Um, I hope to be there soon. I don't think it's going to happen next week. I mean, um, don't think that's going to happen. But hopefully in the next couple of weeks, the next two weeks, that it will. That's that's what I'm hoping for. Um, again, thank you guys so, so much for watching. Thank you guys for being so kind. And I really do appreciate each and every one of you. If you guys have any questions or comments, please leave them below. And um, I will talk to you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.